good morning my friends welcome back to my channel i'm finally in ginger town the famous town of the river nile the source of the river nile and right now i'm at the top of a hill and we're going to see a beautiful primary school right now and i'm with the head teacher of that primary school and um, let me just show you it's about uh, after 10 at morning and make sure to subscribe right now subscribe 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 like this video and share it as well but i'm going to show you the view this is almost at the top of the hill here the primary school is at the top of the hill these are the children and this is at the bottom here see beautiful view my friends and this is the head teacher madam head teacher how are you I'm fine. beautiful <laughs> and how long have you been here four months now. four months yes. so you've been at the school head teacher for four months yes wonderful yes. and one thing you have a lot of breeze it's very breezy up here the, the, on the they hill now, they are now doing the exam oh they so do oh wow yes so we'll be very quiet <laughs> <laughs> these are the wonderful children here yeah? yes, outside, outside ah. Ah. ah a mother of a teacher is doing a wonderful job so far yes. i could see yeah. and, uh, This is the school yes. and these are the classes. This is the staff room here. Yes. Uh -huh. Wow. <laughs> oh, they're doing their exams. Uh -huh. Wow. So, um, how many students per school? How many? Oh no, how many students per class? Mm, roughly 97 in one class mm -hmm. yes. wow and how many classes do you have seven classes you have seven classes and you have average 97 students in one class yes. wow that's a lot yes. that's a lot of children mm -hmm. and how many children in all in the school now you multiply 97 by seven by seven that's just under 700 yes what that's a massive school <laughs> 600 and something mm -hmm. uh-huh wonderful ah that is the, the, the logo of our school you can use this is the logo yeah. saint john kissinger yeah. um G L G O D P uh, 2003 completed on um, Pagoda stores. Wow, that's a logo. And we have this is another class here. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. This is a teacher here. Yeah, that's How are you doing, teacher? Yes. Inside there we have our deputy together. This is our children. Oh. This is primary, part of primary one. This is primary one. Yeah, part of it. And they're they doing. They are doing the exams. They're doing exams. Wow. Wow. How are you, Madam Deputy? Yeah, good morning. I'm doing good. Yeah. And you have you have a, such a big class. It's boys and girls is mixed. mixed. This is mixed students right here. Mm. Wonderful. Mm. Ah, and they're hard at work. They're doing exams. Mm. Wonderful. <laughs> ah, and the blackboard. What subject? What exam are they doing? They what are, subject? They are doing English. English. Wow, that is good. I'm very good at English, so I could even be a teacher, an English teacher. Yeah. <laughs> uh, all right then, bye bye. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh -huh. this, is an, this is the office. Uh. We have a challenge like here. Uh -huh. It is supposed to be the office of the deputy. Yes. This one, you meet the senior 
education assistant next to the deputy. Yes. But right now, the head teacher's office is closed. Uh -huh. uh -huh. As the store. Wow, we, this, we, this is the head teacher's office. Yes, now oh, I yeah, don't yeah. have. And it's used as a storage. Yes. So oh my lord. To change this one with this. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Another classroom as a library. Wow. We don't have a library. Wow. These yes. books need to be taken out yeah. and organized and yes. repacked. Yes. So you need more space. Yeah. Here we mm -hmm. have the plan of our school, uh -huh. which we call school improvement plan. Yes. Whereby we start the school management and PTA. We want the school to get all those ones uh -huh. that you see them. Ooh. Yes, that is the staff, that, the, our staff. Wow. Mm. Do you have any computers? No. No computers. Everything have. is written. It is just ah, written. Wow, wow. We are here suffering. Wow. Really. So anybody who, who can um, donate computers or school Aunt, supplies yeah that would, would be great be grateful but wow. unlucky we don't have electricity oh. just between here wow no electricity in yeah. this building in this, ah. in this village this part this whole village yeah we don't wow. have electricity mm -hmm. mm. Wow. Mm. So this but school is a chance. But if there is a chance we they can mobilize the community to to get to because the nearby school yes. villages they, yes. they have. Oh they have yeah. so they just have to connect it. Yes. Ah. It is just connecting. I see. Yes. Mm. Uh -huh. Then the children, as I told you, they have that problem of reading because we lack the library. Wow. Yeah, that is why we wanted at least if we could change the other classroom uh -huh. into the library. Yeah. And, um, either this one or, or the that other one. one. Yeah. We, we change it into a library. Wow. wow. So that could be also good. Okay. Mm. Um, okay. <laughs> yeah. All right then. Yeah. And you were telling me earlier that this is a public school. Yeah. This is a public oh. school. Of, um, which means a government owned school. Oh, wow, wow. Okay. We have, we have a problem again. Another problem. And they use latrines. Oh, the lot. Whereby they are. Oh, they are broken. The latrines are broken. They are all broken. Oh. Mm. <laughs> so they could be fixed or they need new? I think they need new. They need new ones? Yeah. Ah. They need new ones. They don't use All of this is a latrine here, yeah. outdoor toilet. Mm. Ah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And this uh, is. Don't you see? Oh, wow, well, wow. You have, have broken. Yeah, that it will break. Mm. Ah, la, la, la. Yeah. can't afford that. <laughs> but we have farming here. Yeah. We have farming that is done here. You could see the landscape is very beautiful. <laughs> this is why they call Uganda the Pearl of Africa. <laughs> very beautiful landscape. <laughs> so, there's a lot of potential in Uganda. Mm. Just need some work on the public buildings and services. And then Uganda will truly be a pearl in Africa. It's not hard. I see the problems you have here and Uganda have. It's not hard to fix. It's not, it's not hard. This is another latrine here. Ay, ay, ay. This is a staff latrine. The teachers latching. Not even teachers. Eh? Uh -huh. We just uh, got one of the children and we wrote their staff room. Uh -huh. we, we are meant to have a separate, but we don't have. But wow. these stubborn children at times they come and open even if you have entered it because they know it is there. Oh. <laughs> ah, wow, wow. Wow. <laughs> this is part of the school farm or this is. Mm, it and... isn't. 
It isn't. It's so. But they hired that one. Yeah. Uh huh. Oh. Oh, I see. Mm. Uh huh. Mm. I see. That's a good plan. Mm. Hmm. Bananas right here. Uh huh. So we want to mix them with this one. I make a garden. Oh. Wow. And you have lots of land yeah. here as well. Yes. So what will you do with the bananas once you um, once they come? We when we get those bananas, mm -hmm. we feed the children like uh, you can. Uh, get p1 p2 p3 mm -hmm. you you prepare they eat yes or, or, or during lunch time yes then another day you, you you get p4 yes. p5 p6 p7 yes. you you boil yes they you 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 give them ah then others other time wow. you can give that wow. also wow they enjoy wow tell me something real quick which latrine can i use very quickly because i need to um go <laughs> oh, sorry. Yes. The other one of the teachers. I could use this one right here. Uh, no. Uh, as if we don't have the latrine. Oh, I could go behind the latrine yes, and just. just let me just. If you so just hold. Even this okay. One. If you just hold this like this. I hold it like hold this. Hold it like this. Okay. And let me just go behind quickly and come back. Okay. The major problem we have, yes. I don't know whether I have uh -huh. this one. Yes. Still okay? It's the still major working problem good. Good we job. Have, uh -huh. Most of the learners, they are orphans. Most of the. The learners, they are pupils. Oh, most of the pupils, the students, yeah, are so, orphans. Yes. They don't have any parents. Yes. So we don't actually get problems with this. Views they want, like a free. Yes. Uh, wow. So these children, you can't teach when they are hungry. And ah. when they meet in the meetings, they say, you, you feed those ones who have brought. So those ones remain without feeding. Oh, uh, wow. So you teaching a hungry child. Yes. Uh -huh. to, to, to learn is not mm, good. Yeah, that ah. is the problem of most So you need children. help from all over. Mm. You need as much help as possible. Mm. Ah. So most of them, more than half of them are orphans. Yeah, you think? almost a quarter of the school. Oh. It's orphans. Yeah. That's a lot still because even if it's a quarter, that's mm. like a um, hundred and something. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of them. Mm -hmm. So where do they live if they're orphans? Mm, no, they all live at uh, five. <laughs> uh, where do they live? Do they have a home? They have homes, but uh, they, most of them they are with the, their grandi mothers, grandi fathers. Yes. They are old, like that. Oh, the parents are gone. Uh, yes. Ah, la, la, la. Mm -hmm. oh, so, it's very tough. Uh -huh. How are you? Good morning. 
and those ones who might be with their relatives, yes. they also have theirs. So it becomes difficult to pay for yes. these ones. Ah. Yeah. Wow. That is why they suffer like that. Wow. Yes. And should we move this way? Will you meet one of the teachers? The one of the teachers. Well, of a teacher. Uh, hello, teacher. Ah, what class do you teach? Primary one, primary two. Primary one and primary two. Yeah, which it may be grade bigger, one and grade two. Bigger, bigger enrollment here, ah, as I told you. Yes. 97, 90, you move from this one, again you enter the other one yes. like that. Aha. Uh -huh. mm. Wow. Ah, tough Condition. conditions here. Tough conditions. But we'll continue mm. to try. Huh. Mm -hmm. So, so the Caribbean, you guys see, the Caribbean can do a lot of work mm -hmm. in Africa, especially East mm -hmm. Africa, mm -hmm. um, in um, helping um, projects like this, schools, children. Um, the Caribbean could carry a lot of weight. We have a lot of uh, people with resources. We could get this fixed easily. And this could be a trademark project for us. Ah, but most people don't know where we are, I think it's a Nevis, but this is changing slowly. Once we get very organized in the future, we could get offices um, in East Africa and we could do lots of work and get lots of recognition. Uh -huh. So, and this is water here? Yeah, this is water. This is a water tank. Yeah, it's a water mm -hmm. tank. So I think we see in all places. Yes, P7 plus. Yes, P7 plus. Uh-huh. This P7 plus class. This is a big, big one. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Water. Huh. and we're coming back around to where we were and we're gonna wrap up this video very soon yes we're gonna wrap it up very soon and um, um thank you guys for watching yes. how are we doing teacher i'm doing well yes nice yes, doing good yes uh, thank you guys for watching this video and we're with the head teacher here and it's about 11 o'clock right now this is beyond in Africa, and, um, right now we are um, visiting the primary school. This is the head teacher right here, and um, we are gonna try our best to see what type of help we can get for this school because, as you can see, the conditions are very bad, but the children are trying. And make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you again in the next video.